Hello and welcome to this tutorial from Navitent. In this video, we're going to look at how to install and connect the Sophos SSL VPN. Go ahead and open your web browser and navigate to your organization's VPN URL. Now go ahead and log in here using your domain, username, and password. This is the same login as your computer. However, if you do have multi-factor authentication set up, you'll have to add that authentication code to the end of your password here. Enter the CAPTCHA. And get logged in. Under the SSL VPN client header, this section here, click download client and configuration for windows your download will start i'm using edge here so it shows up here however if you're using google chrome your download will show in the bottom left hand corner okay now go ahead and open this file so i can just click open file here and here it may ask you for administrator credentials this is where you would either call navitend or get your local administrator to enter the password now it's going to begin prompting you to run the installation. Click next, click I agree, click install, click next, and click finish. Now that the software is installed, a traffic light symbol will appear in your tool tray down in the bottom right hand corner, Sophos SSL VPN client, this little traffic light here. When the VPN is not active or connected, the traffic light will be red, as we see here. To activate or connect the VPN, right-click the traffic light and click Connect. Enter your domain name and password. And again, we're going to have to add the MFA code if you are set up with multi-factor authentication. Click OK. All right, and here is our confirmation that we connected. And now in our tool tray, our traffic light will show green. And that is how you download, install, and connect using Sophos SSL VPN. Have a great day.